Rabbits are out this morning. Good morning. Getting a little exercise this morning. What I'm really doing here is I'm just uh, striving towards consistency. Just consistent exercise every day. Make it a part of my routine. It seems like everybody that lives in this neighborhood goes to work at 7. You know, I've never had to worry about getting run over crossing intersections or stuff. <laughs> what I have to worry about is people backing out of their driveways and not looking. Well, here's what's going on today. I've got to be at Spirit Airport at 10. We're going to fly the Citation XLS to uh, Tucson, departing at 11. Three hours, 14 minutes to get there. Not too bad. This is the weekend for the Spirit of St. Louis Air Show. Yeah, I think they practice Thursday, Friday. The air show is Saturday, Sunday. But we just got to make sure, because the notums, that we're not arriving during the air show. So we have to make sure that we don't leave Tucson before 1. Oh, okay, yeah. Hey, I appreciate everybody watching. If you think about it, if you like the video, give me a like. If you watched a couple of videos, give me a subscribe. I put videos up every Monday at 8. The coffee maker broke yesterday. You gotta view it. Where did the blueberries go? I'm gonna sit right here. Yeah, I get that over with first. But you kind of want to keep it? Mm hmm Are you videoing? Shorts. Jeans. Underwear. Or socks. T-shirt. <laughs> That's as far as my zipper opens right there. I've had this bag over 20 years. It's <laughs> hard to do with one hand. Gotta get some water and a few things for the airplane here. Hi, how are you? There we are, adult nutrition. Of course, I'm not sure why adult nutrition should be any different from any other human nutrition. Oh yeah, here we go. Kind bars, that's what we need. Okay, let's do the cranberry almond. Okay, dark chocolate. Uh, dark chocolate mocha almond, dark chocolate cherry cashew. We'll try that one. That's the spices, there we go. That's good. One thing I've always told people about stocking the airplane when they start doing this is always make sure you stock it with something that you like because you might actually be stocking your lunch is what you may be doing. Okay, now we'll get a couple of cases of water and we'll get out of here, we'll be on our way. Two for seven. That's what we need right there. Tucson Tower, 648 visual, one left. Alaska 648 Tucson Tower, runway one left, continue, traffic will hold position. Continue, Alaska 648. Scott 2989 Tucson Tower, are you ready to go? We are ready to go, Scott 2989. Scott 
Scott 2989. We'll have you going here in just a minute. Uh, we got a citation a couple miles out. Roger Scott 2989. I was going to say, he better get him to go. With yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> Run out of time. I just uh, confirm Alaska 648 cleared land one one left. Alaska 648 uh, negative and only one left continue travel hold position. Okay, thanks. Continue one one left Alaska 648. Disengaged. It's got twenty nine eighty nine traffic seven mile final, Boeing seven thirty seven, runway one one left, line up and wait. Line and wait, one one left, go twenty nine eighty nine. Breaks. Okay, got those covers in there to keep the heat down. This one keeps falling though. Come here, do something about that. All right, it's ready. We'll go in and check in. He's gonna let us. Yeah, he's gonna let us out there. Okay, we're in the residence in Marriott. We just got in here. I just dumped my stuff, turned on my computer. Just want to show you what the room looks like here. We're just right next to the uh, Tucson International Airport. See what the view is like. Well, I've had worse views. But that's not why we're in this hotel, is it? Okay, talked to the lead passenger as we were flying out here. It ended up being about three hours and 15 minutes. Not bad. Uh, they want to cut off the last day of the trip. That's definite now. They, they're pretty sure they can get out of here between 3 and 5 tomorrow, uh, which is good because there's a two-hour time difference here, so it's a two-hour, 45-minute flight. That gets us back after the air show practice tomorrow. So that's good. That's working in our favor. Okay, after we left, uh, thunderstorm has moved in, went through the St. Louis area, and uh, where I live and where uh, Mike lives, we got golf ball size hail. And some people got baseball size hail. Big stuff. So went through, did a lot of damage. Uh, didn't hit the Spirit Airport. Our cars were sitting outside, so it didn't hit our cars, which is good. But uh, we'll have to look at the roof, see what kind of damage there is to the roof when we get back. Nothing you can do about that. You know, just ride the wave. That's it. Well, I said, you know yeah. Well, I left my iPad in the airplane, so I had to go back and get it. But there's the Tucson Tower. Just in case anybody forgot what it is, they labeled it. <laughs> 